Hello? Hi, Mom. You want to know how to do what? Hi, Mom. Today I'm going to show you a quick tip on how to make the battery indicator that you see up by your clock here, how to make that more informative. Right now I'm in the default mode where you can see when I'm on battery power, it looks like a battery, and that black bar in the middle shows you roughly how much power you have left in the battery. That black bar will shrink as the battery runs out. If you want some more details, you can go up here and click on it, and it'll tell you how many hours and minutes are left in the battery. Two hours, 32 minutes remaining. And then if you add power, I'll plug it back in there, you'll see that icon changes to a little plug sign, and then it, when it decides that it actually needs to charge the battery, it becomes a little wavy electricity sign. Now when you click on it, it will calculate how much time is remaining until it can fully charge the battery. Hopefully that'll take a few seconds left here. Okay, so here we see that there's 21 minutes until full. So if you leave it plugged in, it'll take 21 more minutes until the battery is completely charged. Okay, so that's handy, but it's kind of a pain to always go up and click on that just to find out that information. So what I like to do is I click on the battery, I go down to show, and you'll see the default is icon only. I like to choose the time. You might like percentage better, but I like the time option. And now it actually gives me that information right up here next to the icon. I no longer have to click on it to get the information. And you'll see it's actually kind of handy. Now that I've got it in time mode, if I do go up to click on it, it will tell me what the percentage full is. But I don't really care about percentage. All I want to know is how much longer is it going to be until it's fully charged. Or, let me unplug it here. Now it's calculating, and in a few seconds it'll tell me how much time I have left on battery power. Now of course that's just a guess. It's, it's basing it on how much you've been using your computer's resources. If all of a sudden you put in a DVD or start playing some video or something, you know, it'll probably eat the battery up faster than if you were doing something less processor intensive. Okay, there we go. Two hours and 43 minutes left on this battery. And you can just leave that set like that from now on. That, that's how I have my computer. So hopefully that helps. Uh, helps you monitor your battery power and uh, makes your life a tiny bit easier. Talk to you later, Mom. Bye.